Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Margarita and I am so glad that you are here. I hope you stick around and hit that subscribe button and join my YouTube family. Today I'm sharing what we ate in a week. I am a stay-at-home homeschooling mom of four kids, so we typically eat every single meal at home. I am sharing what we ate from breakfast, lunch, and dinner for six days, Monday through Saturday. This is real, guys. It's easy to show you what we ate in one day, but for six days, it's as real as it gets. Keep in mind that my kids are picky, just like most kids out there. There are certain things that they will not even touch, like oatmeal is one of those things. So I have to come up with healthy, healthy-ish meals for them. I do the best I can, just like I'm sure you do the best you can for your kids as well. So let's see what we had this week. So for Monday's breakfast, this is my breakfast. I have a Parmesan egg. I just sprinkle some Parmesan cheese on a skillet and then I crack an egg over it and then I flip it once it's all crispy. Some sourdough bread, oranges and radishes and car uh, cucumbers. And I'm having some oolong tea. My kids are having some blueberry muffins that I baked yesterday, some scrambled eggs and oranges. Um, I also made some chocolate chip muffins though. One of my kids doesn't like blueberry muffins, so he gets chocolate chip muffin. <gasps> And then um, my toddler, who's two, also is having the blueberry muffin just cut up into pieces, some scrambled eggs, bananas, and a slice of orange. It is lunchtime, and I'm having the kale salad mix from Trader Joe's. I just added cucumber to that and crumbled some feta cheese. And we're having quesadillas today. Mine is on the Ezekiel nine grain um, tortilla, and I just have one of them. And mine has beans and chicken and cheese. And the kids are having black beans, cucumbers, and quesadillas. The boys are just having cheese, and the girls um, are having beans and chicken in theirs as well. This is my toddler's, and this is my oldest. For dessert, we're just having one pink lady apple, and if I need to cut up more, I will. I just didn't want to do it so it doesn't get brown, but we're having that with peanut butter. So this is Monday's lunch. It is dinner time. Today for dinner, we are having some roasted drumsticks and then I made some pasta with like a balsamic sauce over it. I made a cucumber tomato uh, salad. There's also some uh, avocado in there and onions. And then I roasted some uh, spaghetti squash and then I tossed it with um, some sauteed mushrooms and bell peppers. And then some cucumbers for those kids that are really picky and don't want the salad. So this is Monday's dinner. So for dessert, we are having some acai smoothie bowls and I topped it with some fresh fruit, coconut, and mine includes some walnuts and granola. It is Tuesday morning and this is what we're having for breakfast. I am having some avocado toast. I'm using the whole wheat sourdough bread with a fried egg on top and some radishes and fruit. And the kids are having pancakes. We had some pancakes left over from the weekend which we had to use up. So they are having pancakes. So it is lunchtime and I made some pizzas for the kids. I am using this pizza crust from Trader Joe's that I picked up and they're a little bit smallish, I would say. So I have four kids, so I decided to make two of them. And for myself, I also uh, made a pizza on the Ezekiel tortilla, which is very thin and crispy, but it's still cheesy and warm, and it's really, really good. I'm also having a Caesar salad, and here is my pizza. And for the kids, I'm serving their pizza with some apples. So this is Tuesday's lunch. It is Tuesday dinner, and this is what we're having for dinner today. 
I was planning to um, air fry these uh, little steaks pieces, but it's such a beautiful day. So I grilled today, so I made some kebabs. I made a cucumber and a radish salad. I steamed some broccoli and I cooked some rice. And I heated up some brown rice for myself. I'm not having the white jasmine rice. And for dessert, today we're having smoothie bowls. This is just mango and pineapple. And we are going to watch a movie. And that wraps up Tuesday. Good morning, it is Wednesday morning. Today we're just having toast because we are running out the door in about 30 minutes. And I have sourdough toast with some cream cheese and raspberry jam on top. And the other one is just peanut butter and bananas. And we also have some beef summer sausage and cheese and some berries. My six-year-old loves cinnamon toast, so that's what he's having. Uh, this is my 10-year-old, so he's having peanut butter toast. My 13-year-old is having the same thing I am, but she's having it on white bread. And my two-year-old is just having the cream cheese and jam on white bread and some sausage, cheese, and fruit. This is what breakfast looks like. For lunch, we are having some sandwiches. We are on the go today. I'm having a turkey sandwich. No, a roast beef sandwich. There's a pickle there. Some veggies. And all of the kids are having peanut butter jelly sandwiches, apple crackers, and a Smarty for dessert. So we are home from our errands that we had to do today. And um, I'm having my second lunch. So this is the half of the pizza that I made yesterday on the Ezekiel tortilla. It's actually really good. It's soft and chewy and it has everything that a pizza should have. And I'm also having some cucumbers and radishes. This is my second lunch of the day. It is Wednesday and we are having stuffed peppers today. So my boys do not eat bell peppers because they don't like the bell pepper. Emily only eats the meat part. <laughs> so for them I made um, little meatballs. I mean it's the same filling as the peppers but it just doesn't have the pepper. And they're having leftover rice from yesterday. It is Thursday morning and this is my breakfast. I'm having sourdough uh, bread with avocado and a over easy egg over it. Some radishes, strawberries, and some um, summer sausage that I sauteed. Kids are having croissants. I pulled these out of the freezer and now we have breakfast. They're just having some jam and uh, banana strawberries and some beef summer sausage. My 13 year old wanted a fried egg with some sausage, some toast and fruit. This is my two year old's plate. She's also having the croissant, but she's having some cream cheese and then jam over that. This is one of her favorite things to eat. Some cubed up beef summer sausage, some a slice of cheese and some strawberries. So this is what breakfast looks like. On Thursdays, we attend a homeschool class, which doesn't end until noon. So we always stop by for lunch. And this time we went to Five Guys, but I did get some noodles for my toddler from the noodle company. I had a burger without a bun and the kids just had cheeseburgers and some French fries. It is dinner time. And tonight for dinner, we are having some grilled chicken. I made some potato wedges, some corn, and this is a salad. This is a cabbage, um, cucumber, radish, corn, dill, and the dressing is just um, some sunflower oil, vinegar, and garlic, and salt and pepper. And I am going to have the chicken with the rice. The kids are having the wedges and my, so is my husband, but I really wanted rice with the chicken. 
and my toddler is having the leftover pesto pasta from lunch that we picked up, some grilled chicken and bananas. Good morning. It is Friday morning and we are staying home today, so we're not in a rush. So I made myself some of these Trader Joe's um, potatoes, roasted potatoes for breakfast with a over easy egg on top, some fruit. And this is just a half of an English muffin with some cream cheese and a raspberry jam. This is breakfast today. My seven year old is having cinnamon toast, some beef summer sausage and fruit and orange juice. My 10 year old is having half of an English muffin, two hash browns, some summer sausage, fruit, and orange juice, and that's just his vitamins. My 13 year old is also having the half of the English muffin, some fruit, a over easy egg, and some sausage. My two-year-old is having um, some toast that's just white bread, with some cream cheese and raspberry jam on it. One slice of the Gouda cheese, which I just ripped up into pieces and some banana. <laughs> it's so hot. So for lunch, my toddler's having the same leftover noodles from the noodle company. These are just the pesto noodles some cucumber and radish. She was really hungry, so she's the first one to get her lunch. Okay, Friday lunchtime, we are having leftovers from yesterday. I'm having the kale salad. I'm just finishing up the bag with some feta cheese on top. And there's some chicken and potato wedges left over from yesterday. And that's what the kids are having as well. Potato wedges, wedges, chicken, apples and cucumbers. So that is Friday's lunch. It is Friday night and today we are having some beef pilaf. Um, it's just rice, um, garbanzo beans, beef, carrots, and it has onions in it. And then we're having a Korean spicy uh, carrot salad. And we are also having some borscht, which is a Russian beet and cabbage soup. This is what Friday's dinner looks like. It is Saturday, this is our last breakfast of the week, and today we're having pancakes. There's some, some people are having scrambled eggs. I am having the Trader Joe's roasted potatoes with a egg, some radishes and oranges. Kiddos are all just having pancakes, lots of different stuff. <laughs> So for Saturday lunches, we always have leftovers. Today I just made a fresh salad to go with our rice. And for dinner, we always get takeout. So tonight we got Chipotle takeout. Um, some of us are having tacos, burritos, quesadillas, and I had a bowl. So this is what Saturday night's dinner looked like. So this wraps up the what we eat in a week video. I really do hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys all have a wonderful day.